properly. So this now this is what? <coughs> no, no, I explained them also what because their peer itself only contacted me saying you have to post about this. Oh, I have to look in the camera. Oh, okay. Thank you. The reaction on the trailer of the verdict, state versus Nanavati has been great. What kind of feedback have you got? Oh, well, I've got wonderful uh, feedback um, where um, everyone has been appreciating my performance and uh, my uh, look as well as uh, uh, Mrs. Sylvia Nanavati. Um, so, of course, that feels really good. Um, you know, because I worked really hard um, on this project um, and it's very close to my heart. So to get this response, you know, just makes you feel amazing. How much do you relate to the story? How much I do relate to... To the story, you mean to say? Um, I could relate a lot to Sylvia, uh, actually, because... Um, you know, she was also a foreigner who moved to India and uh, who, you know, uh, was embracing the culture and, uh, you know, um, trying to fit in. Um, so in that part, I could relate with her and sometimes how you can feel quite lonely because Sometimes it just feels like nobody really understands you. Um, so that lonely feeling and all, I could also understand. Um, so yeah, these were the things uh, which I could relate to, but obviously the rest of it, I had to like put myself into her uh, position and try to understand, yeah. Were you aware the Vatic State versus Nana Vati story when you were offered the web series? Yes, I already, uh, I already knew about this story um, because um, I had been offered uh, the same role uh, four years back actually um, when, it was, uh, when it was going to be a female-oriented um, movie. So that was the time when I actually got to know about this case and about Sylvia. Sorry? Tell us a bit about your character. Um, so I would say, um, what I would say about my character is that um, she's a very vulnerable young lady, but who's also very um, strong, very uh, mentally strong, I would say. And um, she, has, she has courage um, to just you know, be honest and to listen to her heart. She's also very sensible, I would say. She, um, yeah, and she's also forgiving, yeah. What all challenges did you face while filming the web series? Well, the challenge I would say was um, it wasn't much of a challenge actually it was the only thing I can say yes it was a challenge uh, for my this one scene that I had to do inside the courtroom um, in front of like everyone you know in front of um, you know uh, the other uh, wonderful actors and uh, everyone who was in there in the courtroom basically and I had to read out um, this love letter, uh, it's a long scene of mine where I have to read it out and where I have to start to get emotional and towards the end I have to break into tears. Uh, so I was quite nervous about that one. I was like, wow, I really have to nail this one. Um, so that's something I remember which was a challenge, you know, to take that step and do it. And I, when I did it also, I really felt Sylvia so strongly actually because it felt so real. It felt like I was there, Sylvia, standing in front of, you know, all these people that I don't even know. 
uh, you know, because all of them were there in the scene itself. It wasn't like it was just me and we were like cheating the scene, you know. So, yeah, I remember that. How was your experience of working with co-star Mana Bhumi's reaction, Virat Patel, Buddha Boy? Oh, it was a wonderful experience. I mean, Mana of Kohl is such a wonderful actor. Um, they all are like beautiful actors. Like, I really enjoyed shooting with Saurabh Shukla also. Uh, so much to learn from him. Um, so much to learn from Manav also. Um, I mean, everyone, you know. Um, so yeah, it, it was beautiful what, whatever, you know, we created together in each and every scene, yeah. What sort of message is the Vodic State versus Nana Bhutti trying to give? The power of forgiveness. That's what I would say. What after the Vodic State versus Nana Bhutti are you working on? Uh, well, I have my two, uh, two South movies um, that are going to release uh, soon. Um, Butterfly in Paris, Paris. Um, then I have another Bollywood movie that I've finished shooting for, um, which will mostly release next year, I think. And uh, then my next uh, web series that I'm being a part of is actually Inside Edge. Yeah. In future, which genre movie you want to do with which Bollywood actor? And which type of role? Oh. I would want to do, um, there's so many roles I would want to do, oh my gosh. I think uh, because now recently I have, uh, I have done two very uh, like deep and emotional roles, I would really look forward to do something more like light and you know, um, something which is more um, alive in the sense like flirty, bubbly, um, yeah, um, and also I would like to do something which is like very tomboyish, um, that would also be a lot of fun, you know, like a, like a gully boy, you know, like a cool tomboyish girl, yeah, like in a movie like that, that would also be a lot of fun. Um, there are many that I would want to work with, but I know that I really want to work with Vicky Koshal. Um, I'd love to work with Ranveer Singh as well, um, Varun, um, so many, yeah, so many I'd want to work with, but yeah. What do you think about Big Screen? Sorry? What do you think? What I think about digital media, um, I, I think it's great. Um, I definitely believe that it is the future um, because it's also so much easier, right? To always like find uh, content because we're always walking around with our mobile phones, you know? Um, and you can watch things whenever you are free, whenever you have time, whenever you want to. Um, and anywhere you are, um, so I think it is it is great actually, yeah. Prakash Dave, the Indian Ministry of Information and Broadcasting says that actor Amitabh Bachchan has been unanimously selected for the Dada Sahib Falke Award. What is your reaction for this? Well, congrats. I think it's beautiful and uh, very well deserving. Lastly, why should people go and watch the Vodic State? Um, because it's a great show and despite uh, Rustam, um, which I know that pretty much everyone has seen, um, in our show you get to see, you get to know so much of details uh, of what actually happened in real life during this case, what actually happened inside that courtroom. Uh, it's very interesting and of course like beautiful um, performances by such uh, wonderful actors. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Sorry, sir. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.